What's up guys? Time is 2.25 San Antonio, Florida Second bay now. So I'm gonna back up a little bit. Back it up. Back it up like a dumb truck. <laughs> ew, ew, he's not going in. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry guys, it's like 2 a.m. Bottom of light. Okay. So I was gonna say, I'm in uh, <clears throat> San Antonio, Florida. San Antonio, Florida. About to wash my truck. Because it's gonna be a nice day, nice couple of days. And we need to be rolling clean. This guy's still there. He's supposed to move. Get your ass out of there. There you go. There we go. Make sure I don't know, overdo it because I have a car in the back. That should be fine. This guy can back up and go to the second bay. And I can pull right in here. to Miami right now I'm at the Canoe Creek service plaza on the, on the for the for the start bike I'm waiting for Felix to give me a call and let me know that he's uh, he's closing by because he's gonna he's he's coming down to Miami as well so we're gonna intersect here and now uh, we're gonna roll together so it's about 17 miles behind so that's about 15 minutes so yeah, I'm gonna catch him rolling and see what he tries. I think he's driving a company truck now. Or he borrowed the truck, something like that, so we'll see. Uh, I got three drops, like I said, two picks. Yeah, two picks and then on my way to Boston. From Boston, I'm gonna take nine to Florida. I washed my truck yesterday. It's so clean. Let me show you. Okay, let's do it. Only got these to drop off. I was going to Jacksonville. This to Miami, BMW and Infinity, and the Jack goes to Hollywood.
catching up to me and I thought that was uh, another truck that was trying to chase <laughs> I misplaced it's okay that's what he's up to Welcome to Miami. I got two cars on board. It's my last drop for the day. And I'm just here waiting for the customer to show up. I don't know what's wrong with them. It's been 30 minutes since they called Uber. They only live two miles away. So yeah, I'm just, just waiting, I guess. I went for a walk. There's not much to walk. Man, that GTR. I need to have a GTR someday. It's sweet. I guess more like a show off, just a, than a, a driver's car. That's yeah, okay. It's not bad. But yeah, I prefer the R33 or R34, of course. But there's a Hell of money in life. Hundred thousand dollars. I don't got that kind of money. But yeah. Got the Mercedes. That's the place. Just waiting, I guess. Uh tomorrow I just wanna make it to South Carolina somewhere. Then go to Boston Sunday, start picking up cars, come back, come back to uh, Miami, maybe Naples, I don't know, we'll see, Miami, Naples, all over the place, as much as, as long as they pay money, you know, doesn't matter, as long as they pay me like 1200 bucks a, a piece, I'm okay, I'll pick it anywhere you want. Give me cash. Yeah. It's nicer here in Florida now. It's like 67 degrees, maybe 50 degrees at night, which is nice. The summertime is it's not so well, but it is what it is. Oh, also this truck, man. This truck is nice. F250. Mm -mm -mm. Swap like a nice, good engine in here. 7.3 This got a gas engine Yeah Gas engine is not good No bueno Time to go Well, I'm walking back to the customer again It's my truck on the street Hopefully I don't get run over I just want to show you this thing Oh yeah, so we just met out here in Jacksonville. Uh, Park next to Felix. Uh, you can say we're almost the same line here. Yeah. He got loaded with a new uh, the Range Rovers. Yeah, pretty nice. That's a new truck. It's a brand new truck actually. 
2023. It's got death. I think it's uh, yeah, it's got a coming engine. 550. Okay, yeah, it's new. It's new. I just wanted to give you a, a, a rundown. Same uh, wheelbase. It's got a sliding fifth wheel. He's all all the way closed. And let's see what the difference is between 75 footer and 80 footer. I think his uh, fifth wheel size like 17 inches or 20. Not sure. They're gonna look by the tail boxes. Yeah, that's where he's uh, said. That's where mine. About three foot, three and a half, maybe 36, 40 inches. And if he slides the fifth wheel open. Be just enough. Yeah, today is a nice day in Florida. Jacksonville is like 70 degrees or something. 72. That's amazing. 72. Check out this pink truck. I know I have pink lights, but I would probably never run pink truck. I don't know. I'm not sure. Howling cars for a cure. That's pretty cool. I would too. If I would, if I would ever to paint my truck pink, it would be like a different pink, like way nicer pink. This is too pinky. This is like so pinky, man. <laughs> That's cool. They like, they like it, I guess. So it is what it is. This used to be a car whore. It's badass now. Almost badass. She. How much does it cost to fix the front end? Oh man, you probably got a steer blowout or something. Sheesh. Oh, that's a long hole, never mind. I don't know if that's been a car whore. Probably not. Actually, it was a, it was a car whore. That's a head rack for it. So that has, okay. So long hood, car whore. Okay, that's pretty cool. You guys are working. We're gonna go with uh, Felix and see if we can uh, install his headlights or something. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Welcome to West Virginia. Place where we're on the scales all the time. Just kidding, there's no scales here. It's pretty beautiful today. Sunday morning. Oh, look what it says. What is this? Way station. Uh oh. Uh oh. Slash way station. It was 
still sleeping. Wake up. Wake up. Yeah. Got about 300 miles to my drop. Boston. Is winning at life. That's pretty dope. Have some fun in the mud. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. Everybody's trying to pass me. I'm trying to pass everybody. It's a life circle, never ending story. But nobody wants to let me through, so. The way that you need to, what you need to do is just, just cut them off. No, I'm kidding. Don't do that. It's not safe. Just slow down. Take your, uh, take your chance whenever you have a chance, opportunity. This guy let me through. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Made it to somewhere in Pennsylvania, the best area. We're gonna make some lunch. Yeah, we're gonna eat soup called borscht. B o r s c h t. That's a Ukrainian Russian soup, but it's made by it's made like Moldovan style. Moldova. Alex's wife, uh, she made it yesterday, fresh in North Carolina, and. Um, we're gonna eat some now and yeah, we'll keep on going we got like three more hours to boston Ooh. what happened what happened alex that's a brand new trailer man he probably hit some curve or something let's ask him this is five years old it's all messed up that's normal but this is like a few months old let's go ask him Pretty nice day, not much traffic, it was just a little bit of traffic, but not much. Hey Alex, yeah, where did you mess up the trailer? No. <laughs> it's not messed up. It's let, supposed to be like that. Let me show you, let me show the soup to the people. Yeah, that's the soup. Borscht. Go get mine now. It's heating up. We got some mayo. We put some mayo in the in the soup. Some bread. Homemade. And you enjoy it, yeah. Homemade. Uh, what's the ingredients? Meat, beef, beef, meat, beets, carrots, carrots, onion, fried. Yes. And some uh, dill. Cabbage. Cabbage. Yeah, of course. Cabbage. Beef. Beef, who said that? And uh, I think there's some water in there. Maybe some water, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's that's like the best soup from East, from like uh, Russia or Spain. If you're from Russia, again, you know. Yeah, we go get my soup. Ooh, that thing is hot, super hot. Yeah, I got a little bit. What's going on? I know, right? <laughs> That's what you said. Mine's bigger. I'm gonna have to talk to my wife. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Enjoy this. I hope you eat it as well. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. 
поехали. I wanna work. Let's go, let's go.